our next evaluator is language evaluator Tim. He will give us uh, he will give us comment to our usage of English. Um, he, his team thought Tim said after after working several years, she he did he think telling lies not a good approach, but he chose to hide or tell less. That's he thought about white lies, and he will give us language evaluation. Let's welcome Tim. Vivian tell us a lie because she tell us I will correct your usage. <laughs> Actually, today I I think all of you gave us a very good demonstration, and your usage are terrific. You are <laughs> so poor. I cannot correct. I'm not ashamed. So please. Turn off, the <laughs> turn off the light. Kill the light. Kill the light. Kill the light. Kill the light. Please, please. Turn off the light. Instead of correct your usage, I will tell you some. Oh, so shame. Too dark. Too shame. Too shame. Too shame. Too shame. Too shame. Yeah, this one. So today I will tell you something about lie. <laughs> And I found some syn syn uh, synonyms of lies. I think I choose three of them from 40 synonyms for lies. I, I searched for the website and I found I choose three of them for you. The first one is bluff. Bluff is a statement intent to deceive or confuse. Some, sometimes you make a mistake and you want to bluff someone. <laughs> you didn't do anything wrong. Or Sometimes you want to uh, convince others you will bluff. And the second one is fabrication, a made up fact of incidents. Fabricate ma means make, you make a lie, and you fabric, you fabrication, and you decorate your lie, and make it very vivid and beautiful. And the third one is slander, I want to share with you. It is an injurious false statement about a person and nowadays in Taiwan, we always see some slander on newspaper. We don't know it's true or not, but sometimes I think it is a slander. <laughs> and I will share some phrase. When you use lie, what, what kind of phrase you can use? First, I tell a lie. I tell a lie, that means I tell you a false thing. It means I'm wrong. You correct something what you just say. You can say, oh, Aaron, you are not humorous. Oh, I tell a lie. <laughs> Aaron is the most humorous person in our club. <laughs> yeah, I tell a lie. You can use this usage. And leave a lie. It is very clear to, to, to understand its meaning, and to leave in the lie. You pretend you are a princess <laughs> or you are a prince. And lie through your teeth. It means you you tell someone something that you know is completely false and you, you can use it to exaggerate the lying and be a pack of lies it means all the things are lies you can, report, you can make a report there are a pack of lies and your boss will kill you <laughs> and give the lie to something and from the meaning of the phrase, you may think uh, you give a lot of light to something, but actually it is to prove that something is not true. So negative plus negative can give you a plus, a positive. And now a lie is a similar meaning. It to prove something really is a lie. You can, you can, you, you think that person always tells a lie, you can nail a lie, you can prove. The, per the people say anything is wrong, it's a false. And finally, I want to say today I learned a lot from Aaron's speech. And one of the sentences I want to sh share to emphasize in the end of the meeting is what the, not this one. <laughs> I, I love this sentence. You open all of your senses to experience your world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is why you can learn in Toastmasters Club. And I want to emphasize this sentence with you. And one day you will see the mountain is the mountain. <laughs> <laughs>